Okay. Now we have a few rumored movies that are coming out. Okay. We got Uncharted's coming out. We know that one. There's Monster Hunter World, Minecraft um, is supposedly coming out, a movie. Minecraft? Yeah, I don't know. I, I read it that it's supposedly it's coming out. Um, I don't know. But here's the thing. If you wanted to make some movies, what movies would you want to be converted in? Uh, video games would you want to be converted into movies? If you were to pick a few games that you would like to see on the big screen, what would those be? Also, I would like you guys in the chat to say that. Just, you know, I know that some of you are avidly against video game remakes into movies, but I'm curious if you were to make video games into movies, which ones do you think would be fun to see? Like someone kidnapped your family and they're like, make a video game movie. Yes. And you better get at least a 13% on Rotten Tomatoes. Yes, at least a 13%. It's required. You know what? That's not shooting very high. But it's so, not. But, you can make that. But for a video game movie, it is. Because some of these are 4% for Blood Rage. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> so what are some movies you make? You, you don't have to give me huge storylines. I'm just curious what, like, what are some games you'd like to see? Mr. Otter said, I think a loose ad adaptation of Fallout 4 would be cool. A man is frozen before nuclear war and thawed out 200 years later. That's pretty cool. That's cool. And then you're, and so I think you're addressing like, hey, let's do something that expands the universe that's already there, but like explores a different character. I think it's cool. Half-Life movie would be cool. Um, honestly, just Half-Life 3 would be fun. That's all I'm saying. Like <laughs> an animated Earthbound movie would be pretty cool. An animated Earthbound movie? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. Maybe that would be bad. Um, one of the games I would like or would like to see turn into a movie just because I think they could build something into it. And again, I think they could expand the universe without recreating it. It's the Halo universe. I mean, there's a lot of Halo media. There is. But I feel like Halo's been yeah. dead for a while. I would like to see that. <laughs> I think Pac-Man for the Atari 2600 would make a dope movie. The bad, the bad one. <laughs> I think, uh, what is it, Sonic 04? Sonic 05? Sonic 06? Which year is it, Sonic 06? Which one was the really that's, good that's, that's Sonic? Sonic 06. I mean, it's Sonic just 06. called Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, Sonic 06 would make a really good one. Um, uh, I think that Halo, if I mean, they just explored that franchise, story. I would like them to explore a different character. They don't have to follow Master Chief. I mean, they could. I think they could make a good movie following it. But um, if they do, they do a different story. But honestly, I think just the Halo universe is cool. Like, I'd like to see something like that at a good budget. Um, I remember there was a thing, Forward Unto Dawn, which actually just got put on Netflix, I think. Uh, or Hulu, one of those. But that used to be, that was like an old YouTube. Like, somebody made like a, a pretty, like, it was low budget, but it was like an indie, like, short film, like, series on uh, YouTube. And it was called Forward Unto okay. Dawn. Pretty cool if you like Halo, um, if you haven't seen it. Uh, Call of Duty movie, but starring the chat lobby. Yes, <laughs> starring the chat, well, not our mean, chat lobby. I think he means it's the, about the it's about the, the the guys in multiplayer playing. They're like they just know they're gonna shoot. Oh each other my goodness! Them. I just thought of the best idea off that. Okay, it's a movie where the people playing Call of Duty. It's not Call of Duty, right? It's a it's a general war game. Okay, and there, it's all these kids in a war game. Think uh, think Jumanji, right? But th now think R-rated Jumanji, okay? Where these kids are all playing on like an online lobby and they're making fun of somebody playing, okay? And that person they're making fun of is like a deity or something and basically just throws them into the game. <laughs> and then, and now, but except when they die, they die, okay? So now they're stuck in this shooter game and they all have to like deal with the harsh realities of like a war and they're all just like these like they're just themselves in this game so they're all like out of shape or like uh, like or are just like air, like all these like kids and stuff like there's all these just like people that are like ragtag group of people that are not prepared and they're all just getting killed and they're just like they're trying to like fight off like and you can even have, like, they're on the same team, but, like, the enemies are, like, computers or, like, are just regular people playing the game. And they don't realize every time, like, you kill them or, like, they're actually dying. They you, like, feel the real pain of death. Yes, I mean, exactly. Like, it's actually, like, an R-rated because it's, like, they're getting, like, killed legitimately. That'd be, like, a scary movie. Wouldn't it? They're, but, like, it's basically regular people that were, like, talking crap on, like, a video game. And it shows them beforehand. 
like as gamers where they're all just like talking crap all to each other and they don't see it and there's an underlying message and the underlying message is that like be careful what this what you say to people online like you should treat people with respect even when you're online it's like it sounds more like a, not like a movie but more like a you know like just a short film on like you oh i think it could be a movie i think you could I think about, like happy movie. death day was a movie usually like repeat but anyway, uh, Spider-Man 2, Pizza Time Simulator, the movie. That's a game, that right? the movie. So you make the video, the movie into the video game into the movie. I like it. How about Elder Scrolls, on, uh, Elder Scrolls Skyrim movie? I Again, I think you could do it. Um, I think at that point, I think you could make an Elder Scrolls movie. I don't think you have to do Skyrim. But yeah. Um, Sword Art Online, yes. No, but like they actually, like I get that they died in that too. But like this one, they're like aware that they're dying. Like I don't know. It's like very like, I don't know. I can see that movie being incredibly controversial. Absolutely, it would be. And I think that I think it'd be interesting, though. I don't know. I think it'd be cool. Um, it really makes you think about what you're simulating when you're just shooting people to death over and over again. Exactly. Like, that's my point. Like, it would be very, like, it would have such a meta meta narrative, wouldn't it? I was thinking a movie where, for some reason, the main protagonist could talk to his main in some fighting game. And he discusses why he, he just talks to him why he plays him. And why he thinks he can really win next tournament, and the the, the 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 character doesn't really understand this, and it's a kind of a narrative on what meta gaming is, like the, the things within the game don't understand the, yeah. the strategy. So he's describing him. He's like, "I really can do all this." He's like, "I think so." <laughs> that would certainly like, be interesting. Him. And it's like all about the connection between this, this avatar and this player. I like that actually. I like that. We like controversial here, GB Crash. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I can see that movie being incredibly controversial. Um, okay, what's another movie that you would suggest? Or a game? A game. Again, you guys can drop in the chat anytime you have ideas. Uh, what did I play recently? I played Hollow Knight. Actually, okay. Hollow Knight. Yeah, that doesn't really work. Because the kind of narrative... Like, Dark Souls wouldn't really work as a movie, I don't think. Okay. I'm just getting rid of options now. <laughs> um, okay, so so I have another one. I'll throw another one out. Um, <laughs> Bioshock. I've been thinking they could make a great R-rated Bioshock. Follow honestly, you can follow the original mo- uh, the original game, readapt the original game, um, because it just has an incredible storyline. But like, make it dark. Like it should be dark and scary. Like it's a horror. Thr- like it's like a thriller. Um, very eerie, very dark setting. Um, I'm trying to think of who would do a really good job doing that or like what could be like a good movie that would be like, I like make it like this. Um, okay. So the style, the kind of feeling that you should get should be something like, um, um, the Will Smith movie, uh, with, with the vampires or zombies or like I am legend. So it has an I am legend vibe to it. Or not vampires. <laughs> they're actually technically vampires. In the book, they're vampires. What is the technical definition of a vampire? Well, the technical is that in the book, they're vampires. If they look the same, they do the same thing, but they're vampires. I don't know. That's just that's what they are, I guess. They totally dog in the book. That movie Sorry, movie video game movie. So Shrek Super Slam the movie. Shrek Smash and Crash Racing the movie. Bookworm Adventures Deluxe. I love it. Shrek 2, the video game, the movie. <laughs> yes. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. <laughs> um, okay, so... Um, what am I thinking? I Am Legend is a great movie. That's what I'm saying. Like, If you brought that kind of feeling to a Bioshock film, you get that scary like underwater feeling, but you also have like the seriousness. You have a good character. Um... Yes. Might have been, might have been a good you don't movie. make it too actiony. It has action in it, but you don't make it like action dependent. You make it like suspense dependent, where it's like you're legitimately scared, and like you're trying to like make your way through this underwater city, and then like you have that like revelation at the end, the plot twist of the end game. It's a really good game, and it's got a good story. Um, and then you have the big daddies. Yep, that's right, and that's important. Um, There's one big daddy at the end. Just one. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I think it's got a lot of potential there. I think it could be cool. Um, so the next, uh, what else? Do you have another one you would think of? I have a, I have one or two more that I could think of that would be fun movies to make. 
I don't know. I feel like they have a lot of potential with these, like, bunch of RPGs, but they just don't do it. Like what? I have no idea. I don't know why I even brought that up. I mean, Final <laughs> Fantasy, but, that, that, but those movies aren't that great. They made Final Fantasy movies. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, there was an Assassin's Creed movie that didn't do very well. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, there was. What do you think about ogres, Burke? Um, I don't know how to answer that. If we go in the vein of Angry Birds, what if Dodge. we just do 2048 the movie? 2048? Why? Candy Crush the movie. Actually, Candy, they, Crush the movie. Candy Crush is a nat Candy Crush the movie is a natural uh, sequel to the Emoji movie. Oh, they can do Clash of Clans movie. Guys, Clash I just beat Clans. the final boss. Can we appreciate this? Pick a pick. Pick a pick was the final boss. I guess so. Pick a pick died. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> oh jeez. GV crash. <laughs> too soon. I don't know if it's too soon, but it's just too much. Soon. What do you know about GB Crash that we don't? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to get out of here, though. Is there a shorter way out of here? That's your house. You live there. I really hope there's You a have so much there. there. You just, like, steal. Who if put they this made stuff a Persona here? Movie, like, but kept, if they made a Persona movie but kept the anime visuals, that would probably be dope. Okay. There, is a there is a Persona movie. For Persona 3, I watched it. It was animated. Really? Oh, well, yeah. there you go. Snaps, you, you did not do your research. Oh, no, no. It's That's not good. very good, but it's Now I'm going to die that I've beaten the ball, final boss. Um, oh, I want Gankies. Um, what does the crown mean? <laughs> uh, Raider has an interesting one we're just going to ignore. Uh, but hello, Raider834. Nice to see you, man. Uh, all right, a Pokemon Emerald movie where everyone hates on Wally. Okay, fair enough. Like Wally, like uh. Snap says Pepe hands. Thank you. <laughs> um, can I just die in this game so I can like get my? Do I use heaven. Go to Temtem Heaven. Do you want to go to Temtem Heaven or Temtem Hell? Uh, the video game. Maybe Temtem Hell is more interesting. Cooler Pokemon? Cooler Temtem? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'd uh, pass, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> uh, pass on either. Can I just stay alive for a while? Figure out what this what the game's all about? You can't escape death. Have you ever even read Gilgamesh? No. No, I haven't. <laughs> You've never even heard of the Epic of Gilgamesh? I have heard it. I have not yeah. read it. Screw you, Wally, and your stupid rats uh, Ralts on first try. It took me 30 minutes to find one. Do you guys, hey, do you guys actually have any other suggestions for uh, for video game movies you'd want to see? Or are you guys, I mean, it sounds like a lot of you are just pretty much like, I don't want to see video game movies, which is fair. I think a lot of people are, uh, I read it and I forgot. Sure, you know, there's not enough, like, original ideas in Hollywood. So, like, a video game movie is not an original idea. It was already a video game. It's a good point. So, so I think maybe people are burnt out, that they just keep trying, they, they won't try to make new things. I disagree that they won't try to make new things. I think there are a lot of good original stories being told. Um, the thing is, they just get significantly less recognition uh, than, than you know these these big properties, which does encourage more of those big properties. What the heck are you fighting? Tony Hawk's Pro Skater movie. That'd be like a documentary, just following Tony Hawk. I guess he could. Or the creation of the video game of how they made it. <laughs> Again, yeah, it's all documentary though, right? Like, documentary. Um, I don't know. Duck, so, dude. so 